What is up, friends? I am out at Broken Straw again, trout fishing. I, today, I'm using my five weight, nine foot Fenwick Atos instead of my Helios 3D five weight, nine foot. So I'm using this rod because I wanted to experiment a little bit uh, with a softer action rod or a slower action rod, which the Fenwick Atos is. Uh, and I want to see if it helps me with my line control on the stream today. Also, once again, I brought out a cup of coffee, uh, which is awesome because it's really brisk. It's just getting above 30 degrees, uh, <laughs> and this right now is a lifesaver. Yes! Oh yeah! Baby! Wow! And it fades away. Fades, 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 fades. And finally disappears. Man, all I can say is hooking into that Palomino and landing it makes setting up these camera shots all worth it. Oh wow. <sighs> you definitely seen better days. The whole head is smashed. But put up one hell of a fight. Oh man, he's beat up. Don't fly that time. This butte. Look, pretty colors. See you later.
Yes, one. brown oh yeah come here buddy oh yeah wow oh yeah brown yeah or tiger trout oh it's a brown beautiful What a beautiful fish. Okay, I just switched out to an olive elk. I just switched out to an olive elk hercatus. I can see the fish out here and they're rising. Um, so. I'm going to be pretty excited if I can get one on the dry fly here. Oh my gosh, it's the <laughs> dry fly I eat, baby. <laughs> oh, I just got off. Oh, oh wow, that was amazing. That was awesome. Yes! No! What happened? Oh, I missed him. Oh, he rose, ate it, took it, everything. It was beautiful. Let's make it happen again. Yeah, sleep at the wheel. Just throw on a chunk here. Boom, there we go, there we go. Chunkier El El Caracatus, and that thing absolutely smashed it. Chunkier. Oh yeah. <laughs> yep. That was awesome. <laughs> Yeah, they like the pipe. Oh, that was awesome. First dry fly catch I've ever had. It's a beaut. Beaut little stocky. So I want to take a moment here and explain that trout fishing uh, is new to me in general and fly fishing for trout is also new to me. And today started off with 30 degree air temperature and the nymph bite was on. Fish were absolutely taking it left and right. I probably would have caught, I don't know, 20 of them had I not been trying to set up all these cool different camera shots. Uh, but by noon, it went to 65 degrees air temperature. So you had a change of about 35 degrees throughout the day. And at that point, the trout started refusing any nymphs and uh, there was a hatch going on and they started taking dry flies and that was really awesome to experience uh, something I've never that type of cycle throughout a day I've never experienced before uh, and so I'm just I'm really enjoying getting into this new world of trout fishing on the fly rod so I am still learning I'm still figuring it out um, and uh, if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel. I'm so close to a thousand. I'd really love to hit that milestone and would appreciate you helping me get there.